In just seven months, select theaters throughout Miami-Dade County will be rolling out the red carpet for the Miami International Film Festival 2010. If you are interested in either submitting a film for consideration or becoming a volunteer at the event, then listen up. Volunteer for me, I think, is one of the best experiences for any student to learn what the business is about. Um, and we encourage a lot of the students to volunteer at MIF because we, they learn a little bit what the film festival is about. Right now, the festival is all about accepting submissions for their many competitions. Early submissions will be accepted until September 13th. Final submissions will be received until October 18th. Films submitted early will be able to save on the cost of entry fees. All films must meet specific criteria for eligibility and must not be exhibited commercially in the United States prior to the festival. Festival director Tiziana Finzi explains. So if you bring a USA premiere, you give, you offer to the audience something special, I think. Okay, I need probably the time to educate the audience because uh, cinema means also entertainment. But you can give, uh, you can find entertainment every day in the blockbuster or in the cinema. Filmmakers should include two DVDs for each film they submit. Films can also be submitted for multiple categories, especially if the filmmaker is from Miami. We have a big festival, so we were feeling that a little bit of the students and the Florida filmmakers were kind of lost in the program. So we started to create a program called Florida Focus that started like I think three or four years ago. But the, uh, last year we started a competition basically for Florida filmmakers. Um, the film can be either be from a Florida director, a Florida producer, or the theme of the film can be from Florida. And it can be in every dif different category, but specifically we started for the, thinking about the, the, the students a short Florida Focus competition, which is, um, we encompasses the Miami Mini, which is for regular filmmakers, and then social shorts competition for college and high school students. Mm -hmm. So we encourage the filmmakers from the Miami Dade College to, in any other uh, uh, college and in, in high school in, in Florida, to submit the films to us, and like that they're going to be showcased in a better environment for them. It's here, on the fifth floor of Building 5, where all the hard work for the festival takes place. And though it might seem like a ghost town now, there's a lot brewing. We have a lot of internship in, inside the, the film festival throughout the year. For example, this year we have interns that are here from other schools in, in, in Atlanta and they are doing the summer here and they come over to, to, to learn with us. Uh, especially if you want to do TV, cinema, entertainment, even the business part of the film, I think is a very good experience. It's a very hands-on program, you know, you learn a lot, you, you have a little bit of, you understand what a back, backup of the film festival is. If you volunteer, you, your experience is going to be mostly during the film festival, which is the 10 very intense days, but it's also very fun. What's Cinema 360 and what's the purpose of that? Cinema 360 is that we have three major com competition, uh, which is the World Competition, World Cinema Competition, the Iber American Competition, and the Documentary Competition. Those films can only be in competition if the, if the director has only done up to four films in their career. Uh, but there are so many filmmakers around the world that have done more than four films. So we, we put them in together in the Cinema 360, so it's like the 60, 360 degrees around the world. Most of the films featured in Cinema 360 won't have distribution throughout Florida theaters. So thanks to the program, this is the only place local audiences will have the opportunity to see these films. This is my uh, energy, this is my job with my team to put a sign of the international map and maybe the first year we are not on the temp top 10, maybe 20, top, yes, top, or we will, I think, if I have the occasion to bring Miami on the top 10, I hope, with Cannes, Venice, Berlin, uh, Rotterdam, Sundance, Tribeca, you know, because, um, for, first of all, I change the identity. I add one section that it's more experimental, devoted to visual, visual arts, open to students and the most famous artists and the most famous art gallery all over the world. And this is the only film festival that do this. So if you want to take part, visit the festival's website at www.miamifilmfestival.com. From Miami-Dade College, In Focus, I'm Sam DeFreeze.